Pardesi squad. Assalamu alaikum. Now guys, I don't want to make this video into a big fancy roast video or anything. I just want to get straight to the point and basically want to get something off my chest. And I feel you guys also deserve to know the truth. As some of you guys may know, I am currently in Dubai and I was at this event where I seen this clown. And guys, this clown talked so much shit about me on the internet. Soon as I came in front of him, I kid you not, this guy did not even have the guts to look me in the eye. Wow. Now you guys are probably wondering that who is this clown that I am talking about? Now, you guys may know him or most likely not know him, but he goes by the name of Slim. Oh my God, wow! <sighs> you guys are probably thinking this is some sort of joke, right? This is no joke. And let me explain why. So a few months back, I was watching this clip on YouTube and I just remember watching him, well, trying to do boxing. And I was like thinking to myself, like, what is this clown doing? Guys, I was in stitches. At first I thought it was some sort of comedy shit going on. But when I realized the serious boxing happening, I, I was, I just lost my shit. So me being a fan of the boxing sport, I decided to let him know how I felt about his performance and give him basically my honest feedback. And as you can see, his ass caught on fire because deep down he really knew that how shit he was. And to be honest, I didn't even know who he actually was until I watched that clip. And then I found out that this guy is actually just Adam Sally's left testicle, AKA Kabatata. Calm down, calm down, set, set, set. As you can see, this guy just kept on barking. Yo, you hit me up saying I'm overrated, saying all this shit. I'm giving you an opportunity to fight in Dubai. You getting paid and everything, flights and everything, bro. If you're not taking this, you are a certified pussy. Seriously, if you don't take this opportunity, you pussy, man. Be a man, back up your words, bro. You talking all that shit, bro? Be a man, back it up. And by the way, man, just letting you know, man, I will put you on blast. You will be put on blast if you don't take this fight. I'm going to put you on blast. Just letting you know that. And what is this kissy thing going on? I know you swing that way. Damn! And I suggest you lay off the boxing and go to school because your spelling and grammar is just appalling. And guys, generally, I had a serious family issue going on at the time, which is why I didn't want to, you know, leave my family behind go to a different country just to punch this guy's cunt in. Plus he was a nobody. Look, let's just face it, right? When I came in front of you that day, you couldn't even look me in the eye because we know that you are a pussy. So therefore, I wanted to expose you and of course, call your ass out for a boxing match, which we all know that you are not going to do and you are just too busy playing hide and seek because you are, you are scared. scared. But still, the fact is you're in Dubai I'm in Dubai, so why don't you just man up and back up your words and walk the talk? <laughs> and you said to me that I'm too scared, I'm a pussy, blah, blah, blah. But if you duck this fight, then what does that make you? Full of shit. shit. And you should be glad I'm giving you this opportunity because we all know you're just simply Adam Sally's bitch. Your main channel doesn't even hit half the views of my second channel. Irrelevant. And that just tells you that I am not in this for the clout. We don't have to have a big fancy event, big fancy arena. Nope. If you want to do this even in my back garden, no problem. Have no cameras. Probably be better for you because it will save you a lot of embarrassment. So Mr. Slim, man up. You think you're so good at boxing, then I should be a piece of cake for you. And Pradeshi squad, you know when you say something, you always back up my shit. shit. And for the people who are doubting me, I suggest you think twice. Guys, I want to write all of the hashtag Man Up Slim in every place and make it trending so that it will know that it won't be easy to take Pakistanis. And Slim, when you feel this Pakistani muck up your chin, you are going to get shattered. 